With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So our question is: Two wires A and B are made of same material. The wire A has the length L and the diameter R, while the wire B has the length 2L and the diameter R by 2. If the two wires are stretched by the same force, the elongation in wire A divided by the elongation in wire B is. Our options are 1 by 8, 1 by 4, 4 and 8. Okay. So let us suppose for a wire which is stretched by a force of F having modulus of elasticity E. Okay. So the stress developed in it will be force upon area. Correct. Now as we know that the modulus of elasticity is the ratio of stress upon strain. Correct. From here what we can say is strain is stress by modulus of elasticity. Correct. Now substituting the value of stress over here what we will get is strain is equals to F upon A. Correct. Now what is strain? Strain is the change in the length upon the original length will be F upon a correct from here what we get is delta l as fl upon a correct now the area will be the cross sectional area so fl upon pi by 4 d square e correct now talking about the question that wire a let us suppose this is a wire a which is stressed by a force of f and the wire b is also stressed by the same force f made of the same material so the Young's modulus or the modulus of elasticity will be same for the wire A and wire B correct now the length of the wire A is given as L and the diameter is given as R and the length of the wire B is given as 2L and the diameter of wire B is given as R by 2 correct now from here what we can say is the change in the length in the wire A by using the expression above we have got that FL upon pi by 4 d square E. Okay, so the change in the length will be FL upon pi by 4 R square into E and the change in the length for the wire B or the elongation in the wire B will be coming as F into 2L upon pi by 4 into R by 2 whole square into E. Correct. Now we have to take the ratio of the elongation in the line wire A upon wire B. So from here on putting these uh, respective values we will get as 1 by 8. Okay. So the ratio of the elongation of wire A to wire B will be 1 by 8. So checking from the options what we get is option number 1 is the correct option for us. Okay. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.